This is uh, Brian again, and we'll be talking about the ACCA paper F5. Uh, it's going to be a very short video on material price variances. In the F5 paper, they can be split into planning and operational. Planning means between budgets. So we'll be going, going to be looking at budgets. And operational is between the budget and the actual performance. This video will only focus on calculation. Theory will be discussed in another video. So whenever we look at a question in the exam, what we are looking for is a set of four things. First of all, you are looking for the standard price. Now the standard price is the original budgeted price per unit. You'll be looking for this in the exam paper. The second thing we'll be looking for is the revised price, which, is, which means there is a change between the, an original budget and a revised budget. So we are looking for two budgeted prices, one which is earlier and one which is later. The budget has been revised. So you need to keep this in mind when you're looking for data. We'll be also looking for the actual price. This is the money you actually pay for the material. You're going to look for this in the question. And finally, you will have actual quantity. This is the actual quantity of material purchase and use. You will see a few types of quantity like standard quantity and revised standard quantity. Ignore all that, just look for actual quantity. So now we'll be going to the format. The format has uh, three different levels. The first level is we, will go, we are going to calculate the material price planning variance. The formula is the standard price which is from the original budget minus the revised price this is from the revised budget so this they are both budgeted they are not real okay you'll be looking for this in the question multiply by the actual quantity will be the material price operational variance this formula is price price so this is your revised and minus your actual price. So revise minus your actual price, multiply by actual quantity. And together, these two, when you add them up, you will get total material price variance, which is between the original standard price, this is the original budget, and the actual price, which is the money you actually pay for your materials. So in summary, we are looking for four different types of data, standard price, revised price, actual price, and actual quantity. And the format, you have three different levels, um, material price planning variance, material price operational variance, and the total material price variance. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you for watching. Please choose a video to continue the lesson on material price variances.